What is up everyone? This is Trang Connor and I'm your coach for the San Francisco Swampers. And today, we're finally back to battling again for the third season of the Indigo League of Legends. If you're new to this sort of thing, uh, the Indigo League of Legends is a Pokemon battling league that I'm part of. I've been part of it for about three seasons now, including this one. And uh, we just started right before Christmas break. Week one has already been posted. If you want to see that battle, be sure to check out my my playlist to see it. And uh, I'll put it in the description for easier uh, access. And so um, after the break, we're now going to be facing Master Roshi, aka the Austin Villa Ampharos. That's a really sick name. Cough, cough. Uh, no pun intended, but you know what they say. Uh, but this was a great battle. Um, of course, if you want to know what my draft picks were, I'll also put in the description that my draft picks were. They're kind of lame, but I was late to the draft pick session, and so I managed to get. Pokemon that were not chosen, so that's the thing. Uh, Master Roshi is actually packing really good Pokemon. I don't know if we're going to win or not, and if I were going to win, I'm going to have to play really skillfully, skillfully, and that's not going to be easy. So, let's begin the match. I hope you guys enjoyed this Wi-Fi battle. Be sure to hit that like button. And subscribe as well, we're 10 away from 150. Uh, but anyway, so, he's gonna start out with a Mega Sableye. Here he goes for the Mega Evolution. And look at that, he's looking right at our, our faces, and it's like, really scary actually. And, um, I expected him to go with a Will-O-Wisp, which is why I withdrew from Samurai to Magnum here, Magnum, being a choice Scarf Magmortar this battle, and I go for Thunderbolt because I I expected him to switch out, but not into Rotom Heat. Here, I go into Spiral, and Spiral is actually a specially defensive Ferrothorn, which, after seeing the light screen, I figured he might just have Will-O-Wisp, or like, an Electric-type move for coverage, but then he goes for overheat and one shots my Ferrothorn. So, realizing that he had overheat the entire time, which wasn't that long actually, kind of makes me feel like like a fool, you know, because I was unaware of that scenario. So we lose Ferrothorn. Uh, that's a little unfortunate, just saying. But that's okay because we can go for a Source Dance and sweep his entire team. Hopefully, because we have to, we have to encounter some obstacles with the Rotom Heat going for the not only the Will Wisp but the Reflect as well. And it's like, gosh, dang it! Because I was like really prepared to sweep his entire team with my favorite Pokemon ever. I actually did sweep with Samurai before, so. I was like, maybe we can try again. But after all those shenanigans, that did that much damage. To the star after, and it's like, really? Come on. And then he goes for Brave Bird and takes out my Samurai. So, unfortunately for me to say, sweeping with Samurai is not going to happen this battle, but we tried. I, yeah, we didn't try hard enough, apparently. But that's okay, we could go with my choice Scarf Magmortar. I'll speed him not, because apparently the Scarfter is also Scarfed, and we're speed tied. And then he goes for Brave Bird yet again, and takes out Magnum. Not looking too bright here at the start of the match, right? <laughs> oh man. But we do get a double down, which are definitely the best types of downs. And uh, on the double down, I go with the Sting, the Mega B-Girl, or actually it's just a regular B-Girl, but we're going to Mega Evolve here shortly, but um, here's Heatran, 
and he could have just gone for a fire type move to end my career, but I was actually aware of that, so I switched out and going to Boxer the Hitmonchan. But my opponent, Master Roshi, switched out as well, and he goes into Rotom Heat. He probably expected me to switch out into Hitmonchan, because obviously I don't have anything to hit the Rotom Heat with except for Rock Tomb, just to lower his speed there. And then he goes for Will O Wisp yet again, which Will O Wisp deserves my entire team. I'm not gonna lie. It's too bad that I wasn't fully prepared for it, but you know what they say. Uh, but uh, it, it just didn't work out in this battle for, for sure. Now, right there, I was actually expecting him to set up a screen or two, but he goes for Overheat as I switch into Lizzie, the Heliolisk. I was like, really? Come on now. And, yeah, so it takes two overheats to finish Heliolisk, and, uh, what can I say? I'm not being aware of what's happening in this battle, and, I mean, I'll take that I just have very crappy luck with this battle, for sure, and, I mean, there's, there's no excuses. We're gonna try our best now to hopefully lock out some Pokemon. Even even if I'm going to lose or something, I, I just have to knock out somebody. So, we're going to finally Mega Evolve with my Mega B-Girl and go for Brick Break. And we take out Master Roshi's second Pokemon, Rotom Heat. We took out Star After earlier, and now we can hopefully take out Mammal Swine. But Mammal Swine is pretty bulky and pretty powerful as well, because Earthquake takes out Sting in one shot. Granted, Mega B Girl has terrible defense. Okay, so I was like, okay, my last Pokemon is Hitmonchan at this point. And I go for Drain Punch. Right there is the end of the match. Yeah, because the only moves I have are Drain Punch, Mock Punch, Rock Tomb, and Rapid Spin. So, yeah, we lose this battle, and it was not the best battle ever. I, I did not prepare hard enough, it looks like, and so I'm going to have to really prepare for next week and hopefully get some better Pokemon or better sets that will correspond better for my playstyle, because apparently this week, terrible loss. I, I played terrible this battle, and... I guess I learned a lot from what I made throughout the match. So, that's a 4-0 victory for the Villa Ampharos, and it's a 4-0 loss for the Samurais. So, uh, not good, but we tried. We tried. Okay, well, that's it, guys. I know that was kind of a short battle, but... That is the battle, that's for sure. I should have another Wi-Fi battle, a regular Wi-Fi battle up go, going up, actually, going up on Wednesday. So, stay tuned for that, and uh, also look forward to next week's ILL Season 3 match. That is such a great sentence, so you're face that. Look forward to next week's battle of the Indigo League of Legends Season 3. Week 3. There we go. Awesome. Have a great day, everyone. I'll see you all later. Goodbye, Chairs.